All right, everyone. My name is Jose Torres. This is my final lab six. All right, so let me show you my name on the breadboard. You're gonna find it actually back here. See, Jose Torres. I don't have the best handwriting. Sorry for that. But yeah, this is my robot. Uh, all of these messy cables are jumper cables, which should be fine. Everything else that's not a jumper cable, you can see here that's nice and clean, laid to flush. All right. So yeah, let's go ahead and test the robot. All right, I will be using my iPad's flash to test the robot over here. So let's go ahead and turn this bad boy on. Just a second. All right, there we go. So I'm gonna shine the iPad in front of it and you'll see that it follows it. Not very straight, but you know, it follows it. Right now it's getting close to collision over here. All right, so you can see that when the collision is on, which is the LED over there, right? Because of the sonar here, it doesn't drive at all. It can still move the servo up and down like I'm doing right now see but the robot itself does not move which is perfect that is ideal so let's try and get it moving again come here boy come on now you'll notice that it doesn't drive straight it's because of differences in the weight in the robot and um maybe a little bit of misalignment on the diode but but yeah, mainly because of the differences in weight in the wheels and all those things, you know? So yeah, I mean, that pretty much does it for my display of the functionality of the robot and everything. It's pretty cool, I love it. Thank you for watching.